Hello fellow Sudokans, welcome to Zen and the Art of the Guardian Sudoku Puzzle. It's Wednesday the 18th of June 2025. I hope you are doing well and enjoying life as best you can. Uh, what's going on in the world? Well, I had uh, misunderstood something. Um, I had thought that backstreet abortions had basically disappeared in the UK um, for since the 1960s. Um, I think they mostly have, but uh, apparently um, there is still some. Uh, there were still some um, problems with uh, the abortion law because they have uh, uh, brought in a new. Oh, they have decriminalised abortion in the UK only just yesterday. Um, since the 1960s, I think it was 67. Uh, you could get an abortion as long as you found two doctors to sign a piece of paper to say that the mother, or the uh, the mother, the, mother, the health of the mother was would be uh, adversely affected uh, if the if the termination wasn't carried out. And mostly, I think it was pretty easy to find a couple of doctors who would who were willing to do so. But apparently, in 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 uh, increasing numbers, there have been uh, prosecutions against women who've had abortions. So good to see that uh, now decriminalized. And uh, the vote was about um, three to one. The ratio of votes for MPs in the UK was about three to one, which is, I guess, probably about the level of uh, um, support in, in a general population. I would guess that's a pretty, um, pretty much a... Uh, um, uh, uh, representative proportion all right anyway it's good news i think let's get on with our game of sudoku there isn't much good news floating around nowadays let's start with sevens blocking down here and seven across here what have i got for you this is the los angeles times expert level puzzle i apologize i've hit the wrong key thing me bob i hit the wrong key on the keyboard and it's caused a tiny seven to appear Never mind, we've got seven blocking across here and across here and down there. Let's see if we can get a proper size seven this time. Indeed, we can. We've got nine across here and nine across there and a nine down there. These nine and threes are very close together, aren't they? Look, they look enticing, don't they? In a straight line like that, that means that nine and three are up there. Okay, that's a three and a nine in that, those squares. What does it mean? It means one is in those squares and therefore there. Is that helpful? I'm not sure. This is three and nine, so these squares are uh, one, four, five, I think. So that means the five blocking there will give us five in oh wait one four five that's one and five blocking that square that means that's a four then isn't it and this is going to be one and five up there is that right this was three nine yes that's got to be one five yeah that makes sense one and five in those squares there Uh, we've got a couple of twos there. Now we know this is three and nine, and now we've got twos there. We've got ones there. So one, two, three, and nine there. Uh, anything else with those twos? Wait a minute. I, I did that rather too quickly, not paying attention again. Fours across here. Uh, if this is one and five, 
that means that the remaining squares are four, seven, and eight, doesn't it? Is that right? Four, seven, I think it is. And we've got seven and eight here. So this square here can't be seven or eight, must be four. Uh, we do have seven up there, seven across there and there. That gives me seven in that square. Uh, I've just noticed seven and eight blocking up there. So that's a pair. Or, we, or, or rather, anyway, we knew that was one and five, right? So we can see that that's seven and eight now. So eights will be over there. What are we looking for? Five, six, eight in this column. Five, uh, six. No, I don't know anything. Okay. That means gives us eights there. Hmm. Not making it very far, am I? Uh, okay, I think I'm just going to hold on just one second. I'll just have a final dash around and I shall move to the pencil mark candidates to help me finish the game. All right, let's uh, let's just do it. We've got ones blocking across there. That's going to put ones into those squares there. We've got ones here. We've got ones up there. Uh, let's put the fives in here before I forget, and let's put in the three and the nine up here before I forget, because because you know how forgetful I am if you're a regular on this channel. We've got eights over there. We've got fives blocking up and across there. That's a pair of fives there. So we have a pair of fives there. We've also got fives in these squares down here. 
Uh, and we've got something else. Don't we? Six, eight. Uh, we've got seven and eight here, right? So the eights must be in those squares there. One down here. Two up there. Threes in these squares, threes across there, threes there. Okay, I think that's it then for me. And so let's just put in the other candidates. So that's a six down there. Uh, we've also got, and that block is finished. We've also got, and this block is finished already. Six blocking like this. So we get sixes in those squares. What else is missing here? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Nothing else, that is it. Uh, Okay, so where to go? Um, not really sure where the best place is. We'll just go along the bottom here, I guess. Two blocking across here like this. Any others? When we get a triple there, two, three, four, seven. Are there nine? Is there? No, I'm not going to get it. Uh, anyway, <laughs> I just suddenly thought of something. But anyway, that's not going to work. Five's block down there. That's a pair of fives there that I should have put in a moment ago. Doesn't matter. Sixes. I like this. And what do we know about eight? Eight blocks down here like this. Ah, eights are in those squares there in the bottom row because we've got eight blocking this square here. So is that a two then? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and nine. I guess it is. That must be a two, that must be a three. And we get rid of the two and the three there. And we get rid of that three there as well. And what else do we know about twos? We've got a pair of twos over here then. Uh, any more? Uh, not sure. Okay, so we've got eight blocking down here like this. That's an eight. Is there anything else missing? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Okay, that's it. One, eight, six, two, okay. All right, it's looking okay, I guess. Uh, any particular place to go? I don't think so. This has got at least a few more candidates than, oh, we've now got a pair of three and six here. Ah, so we, we now have a pair of three and six. That might be useful. So in this square, this square, and this square, we have one five and one five and two, I guess. So we've got two blocking this square, two blocking this square. So that has to be a two. Oops, wrong thing selected. That has to be a two. That has to be a two there. That has to be an eight there. That must be the one, and that must be the six. Over here is the eight. This is not eight. Five six five six. Okay, looking fine. Uh, now, 
so this has to be 1 or 5. We've got 1, 5 there, and we've got the 5 blocking down here, so that's going to be the 5, and that will be the 1, and that will be the 1 there, and then 1 blocking across here and up here will be that's a 1, and then 1 blocking up here and up there will give us a pair of 1s in those squares there. Uh, and this must be an 8, and that can't be an 8. 8 up here, 8 down there, 8 across there. There's an 8 we can place, and 8 blocking across here gives 8 there, 7 there. So 7 in that square, and no 7 there. 7 is now our first completed digit, you'll be pleased to hear. I guess you'll be pleased to hear. Missing digit in this column is in this block rather is nine. We've got nine blocking up there, so we've got a pair of nines in those squares. Threes are there. Five is that? A, does that have to be a five now? Oh uh, yeah, because we've got five blocking across here and five up there, so that is a five. And that must be our nine, and that must be our three. So that means we've got a pair of one and three there, and that means that this is the five. Uh, and not this square here. That must be a 4. You've got to be an 8. 7 and 8 are finished. This is 1 and 3, so the missing numbers here are 6 and 9. 6 blocking across there. There's our 6. That must be our 9. We'll get rid of some 6s across there, shall we? Nine blocking across there and up there means we will have a pair of nines in those squares. Uh, let's just see what are we looking. We can get this, can't we? What what are we looking for here? Uh, two and two blocking up here, up here and across there. Didn't need the second one, but anyway, two there. And that means that must be a two, and this is not a two. I'm not sure whether or not it's a four though, just yet. So I haven't finished all the candidates there. Uh, right, what are the missing numbers here? That's a 9, I guess. All right, and in, let's just see what we're looking for now. If anything comes up, oh, 2 we've got already, 3. We've got a pair of fours in those squares there. Uh, this is the only spot for a six in that block. And that means this is a five, that's our six there. That has to be a one. One across here puts one into one of those squares there. Like that, and which means that this can't be a one. That has to be a one. And this can't be, that has to be 5 or 6. So that can't be a 6, that must be a 3. 6 must be over here. And what are we left with? Uh, something goes there, I guess. Um, are you a 3? I believe you are. So 3 there and 9 there. 4. One, nine, one, three, four, five. Six, five. Okay, that's our, uh, what is it? Los Angeles Times expert level puzzle over and done with for Wednesday. Take care. Bye-bye.